Hello everyone. Um, we are gradually coming to the end of this series, if you would call it a series. Um, and this is one of the last questions, and it's quite. Would I call it a comic relief? No, uh, that was no pun intended, please. <laughs> uh, are the characters in the Bible figurative or literal? Yes and no. The reason why it is yes and no is because a large number. 90% plus of these people in the Bible actually live were real people. You go to many places, including Israel, and you would find um, the monuments and many things pointing to their re being real. Even some of them have bloodlines that are still very evident to this day. So a lot of those people are real, a very large number. If I were to give it a percentage, like... 94% of them or 96% thereabouts are quite real. The others were in parables, like the parables Jesus told, where he talked about a certain Lazarus and the rich man, which most likely was different from Lazarus, who was Jesus' friend, because Jesus' friend, who was Lazarus, was not a leper or was not a poor man, as sorry, I was not a poor man like the man in that example. Or parable that Jesus gave or story that Jesus told so there were a lot of characters who were created there were not so much but there were characters who were created to prove a point but a very 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 large number of the people you would find in the Bible were real people and had real lives and had real events are in history can be proven they were not made up no, they were not made up. When the characters are made up, the Bible tells you very clearly that these people are not real from the pointers that would show. But everyone you see, everyone else is very much real. Even Cyrus, King Cyrus, who was king of Persia, he was prophesied about in the Bible about 150 years before his birth by the prophet Isaiah. His name was mentioned multiple times. And according to history, he was shown those records when he became king. So, there are a lot of real people. Thank you and God bless you.